Okay, go. All right, so today's training tip, we're gonna be talking about how you, with one exercise, you can actually get four movement patterns down pat. So we're gonna look at an exercise that's all encompassing and best bang for your buck. In the past, you've heard us talking about how, you know, your body was designed to do six things, push, pull, twist, squat, bend, lunge. We're gonna hit four out of the six movement patterns right here with this exercise. So Kemi is gonna get into position. She's gonna grab a hold of the pulley and get herself into a half lunge position, right? So now the lower she goes, the better, because that'll work on the, on, the trunk, on the trunk of the legs a little bit more. And she's gonna punch and swim the weight forward, right? So as she's pulling, she's rotating at the same time. So you're getting a lunge and she's gonna repeat that several times in that low position. What you'll notice when people get a little tired, they come out of that position, so really make an effort, to, a concerted effort to stay low. Kemi's gonna switch sides and do her left arm now. So you do about 10 to 12 repetitions of this exercise, and we get into that position. Pushing is always harder than pulling. So again, so she's gonna punch forward, and just get a nice trunk rotation, tall chest, glass of water on the, on the, on the top of the head, nothing's gonna spill, nothing's gonna, nothing's gonna falter. So now Kemi's gonna turn around, and she's gonna do the same exercise, but pulling, okay? So now pulling is always easier, so you might have to add a little bit of resistance, but the same principle applies. Okay, so you'll see that Kimmy's getting a nice good trunk rotation, strong, stable core, legs in a lunge position, push, pull, twist, and lunge. Four out of the six movement patterns. Repeat that in several cycles, and you've got, you've got a great exercise included in your program. And that's your tip for today.